Feast of Mother's Body by Andy P. Chapter 1. Things that mean stuff, but not what you want, especially if you suffer from insomnia and have difficulty sleeping. John awoke from his slumber to find he had wet the bed again. Why, he proclaimed to the world, why is my bladder not normal? Just then, and for no reason at all, his mother came rushing in, only she had no face, and she screamed a silent scream. John flew across the room and landed in a fighting stance. What have you done with my mother? He questioned the faceless beast. When he didn't receive an answer, he delivered a roundhouse kick to the creature's face. It flopped pathetically onto the ground like a discarded towel and started making harumph noises. Then it exploded into action. In one movement, it had flipped through the air, kicked John in the face, and stole a pair of his trousers. Be gone from my trousers, beast of mother's body, roared John as he performed a leaping Bruce Lee tiger kick to the creature's face. It moved in midair with the speed of a bus conductor's wrath at being given a note. It grabbed John by his foot and swung him into bed. As it did so, it grew a horrible frog-style slime mouth and it vomited the words, Give your mother a kiss. Never, said John as he punched the thing in the face. It rolled like a ham roll and landed on the carpet. As he looked over, John jumped in shock. The thing had disappeared. As he relaxed back into bed, he turned his head left and met with the thing. It grinned at him. Give us a hug. It crooned. Its diction was getting worse by the minute. John screamed. Waking up in what he thought was a sweat, John looked around. Phew, he sighed inwardly. It was just a dream. Then his mother burst in, complete with face intact. You okay, John? She asked. I heard you screaming. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. It was just a dream, replied John. Good. She said, because your acting class is in 15 minutes. Okay, thanks, Mom, he said as she closed the door. Just then, John looked down and checked his bed and clothes. They were damp. No! Ten dollars was...